Latoria Watts here with NPC News Online at your 2019 Arnold Sports Festival with four-time champion, wheelchair bodybuilding champion, and Mr. Olympia bodybuilding, wheelchair bodybuilding champion. Yes, awesome. Congratulations to you. Let me know how you're feeling right now. Oh, man. Um, I'm speechless right now. I mean, to be honest with you, I'm speechless. Um, four times here um, and winning again, you know, with the with the lineup that was here, you know, bringing Chris and Anad, you know, from across the world back into the play. And the other guys, too, man, you know, putting the time in and, and the quality muscle that they have. Um, I'm honored to win again. Yes. Mentally and physically, what did you feel like you needed to do to prepare for this show after Olympia? Like, why wouldn't you sit out, take a break? What was it that you wanted to bring or wanted to prove coming to this stage this year? Well, you know, as you know, you know, the wheelchair class is still small and growing. You know, if it was like thousands and thousands of competitors like, the, you know, the Mr. Olympia has, of course you want to sit out and, and just wait for that one show. We still growing, growing the division and we still growing the class. So I feel that, you know, me serving a purpose is still being an ambassador of it, still competing, still out here, still showing quality muscles on that we have as a as a group that bring it to the stage. I still feel I need to do that, you know, help that uh, class grow, help the division grow, and still compete. And I love competing. Now the competitors that came out this time, you de they're definitely trying to catch up to you. They're trying to take that spot. What is it you you're needing to do to just kind of separate yourself from them? Um. You know, everyone look at the size and look at definition and look at um, quality muscle. I'm trying to blend all three, you know. Um, when I notice myself getting a little more size and then it, you know, you sacrifice some conditioning. So you have to attack that side of it. And you're really always looking at myself. I'm asking opinions from um, counterparts. I'm asking opinions that's definitely from my wife, my trainer, my partners. You know, we always looking at my body. and. And just talking to, you know, quality people who know what they're talking about. Listen to what Arnold's saying, too. And look at the Olympia, what just happened. So you got to, you know, watch all of that and then apply it to yourself. Just don't be one-dimensional. Just don't be big. Just don't be ripped. Just don't be conditioned. You, you got to have all. Yeah, grainy. I mean, and bring it all to the stage. And, and enjoy doing it, which I do. Yeah. Harold, what's next for you after this? Um, next competition, I think I'm going to do... Um, I have one in play, it's, it's, I'm juggling with that one, but definitely the Olympia again in the year. But uh, the next thing, again, promote the sport. I'm trying to do more uh, guest posing, more appearances, uh, more awareness, so that the sport will grow and have more competitors that are competing in the qualifiers so that we have a bigger class. That's awesome. Now, what can you give all your fans, everybody watching, up and coming wheelchair bodybuilding um, you know, athletes? All the athletes, what advice would you give them right now? Just giving them hope or inspiration, what would you tell them right now? Um, do you. I mean, learn your body. Get someone who know your body. Just don't get a coach. Get someone who understand your body, um, the wheelchair side of it, and the anatomy of getting ready for a competition. Um, you know, and be consistent and know that it's not going to happen overnight. Put time in. Like I always say, put time in. You got to put time in anything you want in life. You got to put quality time in it. So if it don't happen this time, it won't happen next time. It will happen if you're consistent. So you have to be consistent. I've been doing this for a while, and I'm not afraid to say I'm 48 years old. So I, and actually, I honor that. So I would love to be 55 and still be on the stage and killing it. So yeah, age is nothing to me. I don't, I don't feel it at all. I'm getting better every year, actually. So uh, that's how I take that by the horns. So actually, it's not a, it's not Achilles heels. It's, it's a benefit for me. And most people are hide something and it becomes Achilles heels. But if you pull it back and you acknowledge what it is and you grow off of it, then it becomes a strong point. And quality muscle and age, it, it's synonymous. So that's what, I, that's what I advocate. Just stay at it. I mean, a lot of beginners getting started be like, oh, Harold's the biggest one out there. But you know what? You can be big too, but you got to put time in. That's just it. I mean, it's no, it's no, it's no, uh, it's no cut card to it. It's none. You heard that from Harold, you got to put the time in. So Harold, let everybody know, or actually the thank yous. What are the thank yous? Are the people that supported you, that have helped you get here? Go ahead and say thank you to them. You know, first and foremost, God, you know, for allowing me to be here. Uh, my wife, which is my partner, my training uh, partner. Uh, uh, my second half, she definitely always lined me up what I need to do, what we need to do as a team. Um, my workout partners at the gym, you know, um, the whole IFBB Pro League and the NPC and the staff, you know, Jimmy and, and everyone, um, Weinberger, I meant the guy, the promoters of all the shows that support us and have us at their shows, we know, we want to thank you for allowing us to be here, I mean, first and foremost, and, 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 and the, um, 
the um, the people. You know, thank you for supporting us and and, and always giving us um, props back. You know, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, just just supporting this division. Everyone that's out there to support. We really want to thank you and give you honor for allowing it for us to happen. Well, Harold, thank you. Thank you for talking to us. Congratulations to you. We look forward to seeing everything that you do. And with NPC News Online, we are out.